video, I'm going to show you how to use the crop tool. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do is click on the crop tool and you'll see that it gives you this box here around it. So first of all, what I want to do though is straighten the image because this horizon is crooked. So I'm going to go to the top because you know when in Photoshop, whenever you have a tool selected, it gives you parameters at the top for it. So I'm going to click on straighten. And you'll see it gives me this little icon there and then with the plus and it means I'm ready to drag a line to show Photoshop how to straighten this image. So I'm going to start on one end of the picture and drag a line so that I'm following the horizon. That way it'll rotate the picture and now we have a straight image. So when I'm done, I just press the check mark. Now let's say I wanted to change the aspect ratio of it and make it more of a square or vertical picture. I can just click on it again and it gives me those um, little corner points and stuff so I can drag this and if I want to make it a square I can do that. Notice how it gives you these this grid here for rule of thirds that comes in really handy like let's say that I wanted my picture to have this dock in the very center you know I can move it around using those guides. Alright but I'm gonna leave it like this for now and press check and then the very last thing I want to show you how to do, what you can do with the crop tool. Let's say you wanted to make this have more sky image if you were like completely retouching this photo and changing it a lot. If you click on the crop tool again, you can also just make your canvas size bigger by doing that. So like, and you can press check. That way if I wanted to add extra clouds or things on my image area, you can just use the crop tool to change um, the size of your canvas.